that the Lord can no longer have you far away from heaven. You just, you, you, you can't stay on earth. You've got to go to heaven. It's the language of the new creation that has come to super maturity. It's a language of the high class. It's, a, it's advanced level language. Nobody will understand you. You use the language of men and you just can't fit. God's greatest blessings cannot, 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 cannot be experienced on this plane. When you begin to get in them, you will jog into heaven. Like Enoch did. The Bible talks about Enoch. He says, Enoch was not found, for God took him. He went out to jog one day and jogged right into heaven. They didn't find him again. He was gone. He was so blessed. The Bible says, Enoch walked with. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. It's, a, it's an intimacy with God that the Lord can no longer have you far away from heaven. You just, you, you, you can't stay on earth. You've got to go to heaven. And so Enoch, Enoch, the Bible says, Enoch walked with God. He was a prophet of God, the Bible tells us. He walked so close to God, and by the time he moved into God's greatest blessings, no, no, the heavens just took him out. Elijah walked with God, and it got to the time that God just couldn't have him down here anymore, and took him out. And God's brother, Lego said from the Jolly Cobra and Ruske. Oh dear, dear, dear. You know, sometimes some of us actually do have a glimpse into that realm, just a glimpse. And we try not to stay too long because you stay too long, brother, you ain't coming back. Because at that realm, you don't have words with which to communicate. Paul tells us in the second Corinthians, the 12th chapter and the fifth verse. He said, I was taken. He said, I knew a man. He was talking of himself. He said, he was taken into heaven and heard unspeakable words, which it is not lawful for a man to speak. He said, it is not lawful unspeakable words hey I want to tell you what he meant by those words he was not talking about the way they sounded is the language is the language of the new creation that has come to super maturity it's a language that if you begin to speak brother they're gonna say you are mad you may, be, you may be arrested, I'm telling you. You'll be taken away from among human beings. It's a fact. It's a fact. You can no longer communicate with these base words of man. There's some things that we just have to allow. And, and, and you know, because we will not be understood. If we began to speak at the level of revelation. Let me give you a little piece of this. The other day, Pastor Larry was sharing in church and he was talking about, someone said, I'm sorry to take your time. You remember? And he said, no, you can't take my time. Did you know that there's not many Christians who understand that language? It's a language of the high class. It's, a, it's advanced level language. You understand? Yeah, I'm telling you. It's advanced level language. I was surprised when he began to say it. I thought, doesn't he know? Doesn't he know if he, if he starts to talk like this? Yeah, it's important. You, you have to understand it. It's another. You do not take my time. Because you cannot take my time. And so I do not operate at that level. Take my time. Mm -mm. Why? Because at the advanced level, that means something serious.
And when you begin to come into that level, God says, mm -mm, he can't stay there no more. No, 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 he can't stay there. He's got to come up to heaven. Because nobody, nobody, nobody will understand you. You use the language of men and you just can't fit. You just can't fit. Let me give you an example. At that level, you do not, you do not say, I am hungry. Oh. You say, I eat. No, no, I want you to understand this. Imagine if I came to you and I said, I eat, I eat, I eat. You'd say, pardon me? And I say, I eat. And you say, well, eat what? <laughs> but let me tell you the meaning of I eat in the realm of the spirit. When you begin to say, I eat, I eat, food, wherever it is, journeys to you. You see that? I'm just trying to show you something. That's a, Paul said, I heard unspeakable words. He said, it is not lawful. Read the words. He said, it is not lawful for a man to speak. He said, it is not lawful. In other words, in the human world, they become illegal. It's a high plane. It's a high plane. You don't say, I need some money. You don't have needs there. At the advanced level, no needs. You don't say, I need you. I need, please, I need, I need. No, you don't even tell human beings, uh, I need a chair. You don't need a chair. You say chair. Listen, listen. You, I want you to understand. You don't, you don't say I need a chair. When you say chair. Are you following what I'm saying? Imagine if we began to communicate at that level of revelation. We can't be here. It's called the level of God's great greatest blessings God's greatest blessings and you know what the church is moving there by the time we get up there the rapture will take place people can't understand you they can't understand you so how are you going to be talking to them how they are eat. They say, oh, I don't know. They say something is wrong with you. Before long, they will carry you. Even when you're saying nothing is wrong with me, they say that is what we are saying. You don't know something is wrong. With you. <laughs> now they take you maybe to Yaba. <laughs> Hallelujah. So I'm going to leave that. Oh boy. It's a, you know, Paul said, when I came to Corinth. He said, I could not speak unto you as unto spiritual, but as unto carnal, even as unto babes in Christ. He said, I fed you with milk and not with solid food. That's what he said. He said, I couldn't talk to you as unto spiritual. There are things we cannot say. So I, I said, let me just, let me just um, put that aside for advanced level, advanced level class. You understand? Some of us, if we, if we meet at that class, we can talk. Oh, but shake it, boy. <laughs> hey, hallelujah. Hey. Some of the things we would even say will not rhyme with English language. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Thank you, Holy, Holy Spirit God. Mm. Woo -hoo. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. I hear the Spirit say, the day is going to come. That a generation shall be raised and matured, saith the Lord. And they shall grow in grace and in the knowledge of the Lord Jesus Christ. 
and in the effectiveness and efficacy of the word of God. And they shall speak with tongues of fire and speak the word, saith the Lord, and speak the word of the Spirit, and it shall produce life and light, saith the Lord. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Amen. Praise God.